Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Mashinki as the Coal Express roars past your left ear uh, into Gateshead Station. Well, it will do in a minute. It's, it's got to go and do that at the moment. Uh, now, it's just gone past the junction, so uh, uh, there may be the need for the uh, for the, the logs train there to, to, to pause up a smidge. But here we go. We're going to drop off and, and see what happens here as we do so. And... If we're lucky, we'll get some coal bucks appear down the bottom corner. And, well, there's, there's some coal, look. There's some more coal. This is good. Yeah, fling it across, and it flings some back. I'm not entirely sure what all this flingage is about, but flinging is, con is occurring. Well, there we go, there we go, that's happening. I'm, I'm making some coal bucks. And the good thing about coal bucks is they can be invested in something, uh, I'm sure, sure of that, uh, to, uh, to, to to make some extra things. Uh, and it also goes towards the delivery of coal. So we delivered 33 of 200. And if we have a look up the other end of the line here. Ding, 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 ding. Uh, we've got 39 waiting. So there'll probably be a good 40 or so uh, kicking around by the time we get back. Uh, and that's good. I don't mind that in the slightest. Uh, right, so today our goal is to uh, complete the track construction objective, which will earn me 20 more coal bucks. Uh, second objective is to complete... We're not going to complete that. Uh, is to uh, complete the delivery of coal. We've got a fighting chance of completing that one. Uh, three, 33 of 200 delivered so far. That's good. Third objective, complete the time to progress, which means we need three station extensions and then we have the overall steam power research thing that we've got going on there's a lot of information in here uh and uh, and basically what i need to do is i see how this works when this when when we've got a hundred of either of these sitting around doing nothing we can push the button and uh a voila etc and uh, so that's what that's the overall goal. I doubt we'll get to it today, but uh, that's that's where we're heading to. Anyway, stick around because Stockport is about to enter the modern age. Okay, as much as I reference Stockport, our mission today commences here in Middlesbrough, uh, where there are 875 passengers waiting for anything to happen to them. 883 passengers waiting for anything to happen to them at all and uh, and I really need to capitalize that on that uh, a little better so to get started we're gonna get rid of this depot hold on you broke the track don't break the track there you go uh, and then we're going to uh, we're gonna double up on the station because uh, my aim is to, to fling quite a lot of metal up here uh, and then Actually, let's pause to do this. Uh, we shall uh, we shall remove this chunk. Whoa, 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 whoa. Steady on. We just need to remove a little bit of track. We don't need to bulldoze the entire landscape. That's uh, that's unnecessary. So if we can get to it before this corner, then we can we can bring that in over here like that. You see, uh, how's that done? One eighty. Well, we're gonna we're gonna finish that mission without breaking a sweat. Here we go. We'll now chuck this one up here, or will we? Let's chuck it as far as there, uh, and then see where we're headed. So we're going for Stockport, which is up here on the mountain side, as much as that's not really a mountain side. But we could make this one long tunnel, which might actually be, well, it might be heinously expensive. Let's have a look. Uh, if we were to go from here to there, that's 200 quid. Yikes. We're not going to do that. Uh, we will go above ground wherever possible. Mm. Now, Stockport is, is looking at expanding over here, but uh, I'm going to have a look at putting a station in. Yeah, you see, that, that's that's a lovely amount of catchment. This could be this could be quite a nice money printer of a station. This one, which I've obviously committed to already. How do you feel about going down there? All right, good. All right, we shall go along... Uh, well, will we? We don't want to go all the way up the mountain. That's that's going to be really scenic. So we're going to go all the way up the mountain. Or, no, no, we'll do this. Right, okay, we'll get as far as here. Right, which we've done. And then we shall go around 
like this. So we shall skirt round in that way that a, a mountain side uh, rail network possibly would do, or certainly is doing when I'm in charge of it. Now, can we get down? We can get down there, All right? Now, this, I mean, as much as that is not a uh, as the crow flies route, it uh, it could prove to be quite scenic. Uh, we won't know, of course, until I I, I chuck something up there. But uh, we'll uh, we'll do that presently. Meanwhile, I ought to place a depot that can serve both sides of this. How do you? How do we? How do, How does one feel about? Mm hmm. I'm not thrilled about it. Although, actually, if we put it there, give it plenty of space in case I need to expand further, and then we'll. Uh, Yep, nope, that's it. Just like that. Right, now then, signal up. We'll put one there. Uh, we'll stick one here. Will we? Is that wise? No, it's not wise. We'll stick one here. There you go. And then we'll stick one there as well. That should do the trick. That way, anything coming out of the depot uh, won't proceed until it's uh, until this end of the track, which ad admittedly is quite large, is uh, is clear of traffic. Interesting though, will it consider both these two tracks part of the same block? Answer: Yes, it will. Not something I have to worry about. We don't. We don't intend to uh, to bring a huge amount of stuff out of the depot. Anyway, let's uh, buy ourselves a train. Hey, I've, I've finished my track construction. Hey, yeah, we can we can get some uh, get some money out of that. Uh, right, shall I invest twenty bucks of the plank variety in a fast train? Yes. Uh, no more small trains for me. Uh, and we'll go with the coach car. Uh, that's forty four. That's 55. That's 66. I can do me 11 times table, you know. 66 ought to do the job. Right, you. Uh, then we... Let's kill that. Give it some orders. Go from... Station 0... Up to... Station 10. Yes. And activate. Right then, let's have a let's uh, let's get our let's get the thing rolling. Let's do a bit of this, and I think we might follow this one along a little because uh, that mountain route uh, that looks that looks pretty exciting. Anyway, we can collect our reward of twenty bits of coal buck. Thank you very much. Now right, you're going to wait at the signal. You're going to be quite happily going through there. Everybody's happy about something. And of course, you're going to get to lord it over this chap as well, given that you're uh, sporting the uh, the slightly more high octane engine and the uh, the senior Pullman coach, rather than the uh, you know the, the the cheap young whippersnapper uh, that we're running on the other line. Now, if this one uh, if this one works out, it could be quite the money spinner uh, in the fullness of time. But we do need to get it rolling, and uh, you know I've eroded my my balance there to the point that I might have to wait a minute or two before building something else, which is you know uh, it's a disappointment to all of us, I'm sure. Uh, however, let's uh, do we want to ride on the foot plate or do we want to kernel cam this? Let's do this. See, this is not a mountain. I'd, I'd hope this would be, you know, quite quite an impressive kind of mountainous uh, journey that we were finding ourselves on, but it's not. It's uh, it's just a little bit of a gentle hillside. Now look, see, this is just this. It's, this is very genteel. Yeah, a bit of bit of Kermel cam clipping through. Elegant is what she is. Uh, right, splendid. So we've got eight passengers waiting in Stockport at the moment. That will never do. Uh, so I'm going to invest in this in order to uh, start working on uh, working on the, the grand scheme that uh, that sees me having three upgrades. That counted, right? Yep, there you go. One of three. Ha! 
Now, when I set out to do this, one of the things that I thought was, well, let's go continue on to northeast Lincolnshire. Do we think anything bad's going to happen if I try and bulldoze a church? I know it's not encouraged, um, but, you know, we're not talking ancient Indian burial ground here. I mean, the, the spirits of our ancestors aren't going to come back and, uh, and create all kinds of bedlam. But uh, even so, it's not... Uh, it's not usually considered a good luck thing to do, bulldozing a church. I'll chew on that a little bit. I haven't really got the money for it anyway. Hold on, let's, well, let's at least price it up. There's a building in the way. Yes, I know, but that, that shouldn't be the end of the world. I should be able to... you got a building in the way. So what you're telling me is I actually can't go through it. Even if I wanted to spend a lot of money. Oh, well... I'm a, I'm a complete mug then, aren't I? Don't answer that. Why haven't you got any passengers on board? Surely there were people waiting. What's go Have you got an attitude problem? Or is it because I told you you had to go to the other station first? Can't rule that out, certainly. All right, I, don't, I, better, have a, I better have a bit more of a review of the situation than I have been doing. I mean, there's, there's an unholy number of passengers waiting here. Uh, train 2's got... 40, which we could possibly up the tempo on. Station 2, uh, here at Gateshead, is uh, is terrible. Uh, can we... We can... We could waiting room here, which I think is going to be necessary. Interesting. I thought I'd done this already. Evidently not. All right, well, we need this in order to, to max our, our rev... And I need some Rev Max here. Uh, Rev Basic is not going to do the trick. Rev Rev Max is uh, is the show that we've all signed up for. Okay, you know what? Let's uh, let's increase the tempo a smidge uh, and uh, and see how we progress. I don't, uh, the important thing is that we see the cash going up, and then after the shortly after that, I shall press a few more buttons and see what they do. Plant vegetation. Transparency setup. I have no idea. My company info. I think that might just depress me at the moment. Now, please pay me an awful lot of cash. Okay, cash going up. Cash going up. That's good. Uh, right, we've done two of three upgrades. So I might go and get the last one in, and then uh, and then hopefully that'll be uh, that'll be a good thing. Now, we've already upgraded this station, but we haven't got any new buildings being built. Although it does look like it's expanded since I first kicked off. Because uh, cause Dudley now is uh, uh, is almost merging with Middlesbrough. I wonder if I can uh, if I can encourage that to happen. 21. Is that the wisest use of my cash? No, it's not. Get people in the catchment radius of your station. That's a useful spending of your uh, of your ill-gotten gains. Hard-gotten gains, I think, not ill-gotten. There you go. Like, if, if you do that, and let's see if that is what encourages uh, a bit of uh, a bit of AI construction in this direction. Don't spend more than you need to. I'd argue you just spent more than you needed to, but uh, there we go. Right, okay, that's good. Let's have a look at our company info. Uh, let's start off with a, this this picture of, of a man with a beard. He doesn't seem too cheery about himself. We can change our colours. Oh, okay. Oh, that's fun. All right, uh, well, anyway, so, oh, let's... Let's go with gold. Yeah. Paint it like you mean it. Hold on. I've painted my tie. My tie is now pink. No. Gold tie. Trains. Oh, hello. There's a full list of them. Oh, yes. Ooh. And they've all been painted gold as well. Hey, they look pretty impressive when you stick them all like that. Nice. Okay. Yeah, all right. That's that's good. Uh, what's the cash register? Oh, it's showing me my balance sheet. All right. That's Kill off a few of these superfluous numbers here. Uh, right, so we're in 1926. The uh, the timer at the bottom would seem to uh, 
seem to agree with that. Station's income. Quest's income. Yeah, okay. Infrastructure book. Yes. Where's, where is uh, the bottom line? Infrastructure cell. I thought I bulldozed it. Interesting. No matter. Anyway, we've made we've only made 23 plank bucks this year, which perplexes me a little bit because we should be delivering more than uh, uh, more than ever. I, know, I may need to may need to review that. Train one and train two have stopped for a long time. No, they haven't. Stop it. They wait for one another to go in and out. Uh, counts. Depots, one, two, three, five. Yep, yeah, okay. Trains, eight trains, 11 stations. That's less interesting, but I suspect over time that will become more interesting. What does the clock do? Oh, okay, right. Yep. Yeah. Uh, there we go. So, what's this? Oh, it's doing this. is doing by month. Splendid. All right, okay. Now I see what's going on here. We've got a loan of a thousand. Oh. Are they, are they, I, I would imagine they're charging me interest on that. We can expand this. There we are. Let's uh, let's do that. Actual is presumably how much I've got left in my kitty. Or is that profit loss? No, that's the, that's the profit loss amount. Right, okay, there we go. I figured it out. It didn't take, uh, didn't take too long. But here's our performance for this year. And this seems to be the rolling balance, given that it says 5.30, here, and uh, it's, it's pretty much concurring there. That's what we're up. There we go. I've got it. Right. Sussed it. Ah, there we are. Spending, income, balance sheet, whatever. As long as these numbers all look good, it's all good. Uh, that's going to be my train list again. Yep. Uh, this is going to be the thing I was just looking at right and then medals achievements i think these are going to be work in progress okay we'll worry about that then another time now what else have we got going on here what's that's my quest thing train that road plant vegetation don't really need to do that um good i have now con consider that me having explored the menu Menu explored, and, uh, and, a, and a rare old time was had by all of us. I ought to, I ought to stick a second platform in here, don't you think? Keep these two shuttling along. Hold on, you're having to wait. Okay, that is interesting. And it's because this one's in the same block. Ha! All right. In which case, I need a, I need another signal in there, and that's because I'm not double tracked. Any signal there is going to cause us potential problems in the future. So where would one stick a signal in order to cause the least uh, the least harmful outcome? I mean, if we stuck one there, given it has to go quite some distance. So we now know that that uh, the, the train that's heading out to thing, uh, Stockport, we know that's in a separate block. It's a bit of a concern. There we go. We'll stick one there as well. That's going to break this uh, this depot section here, but that's only going to cause a problem if I don't um, do the thing that's necessary. Maybe double track up some more. So if I buy another train coming out of depot five. Uh, that will cause me some problems, but we will worry about that in due course. The other thing I could have done, of course, is just deleted this bit of track here and then everything would have been peachy. Uh, but I'm leaving it in place because I don't know if I'll be able to relay it or not. Train 6 there, 66 passengers on board. That's the business. But this should mean I no longer get the warnings about trains 1 and 2 having to wait for a long time. Now, I didn't miss that uh, I have finished delivering all of the coal that I need to deliver. Take the money. Thank you very much. Uh, so, we've got deforestation on the go. How are we getting on with that? Progress 289. So, it's still doing the thing. Uh, and then 95 of the 100 coal I need in order to uh, uh, progress my uh, 
my time expansion time extension time whatever the thing is time wise that i'm supposed to be doing we're getting close to it there you go there's a drop off this might actually do the trick you know this might be enough I'm not entirely sure. Four coal makes one coal buck, by the looks of it. That certainly seems like the most plausible thing, doesn't it? There we go. We've got 100. Right, I'm going to spend it. Do so. <laughs> Halfway there. Excellent. Right, so I've just got to put 100 of these chaps in, and I've no idea why uh, Plankwoods is not, uh, is not stepping up. Let's go and see what's going on with the train. Where are you? Right, here you are. 42 of 56. You're not delivering enough. Right, 56 should be an epic amount. You've got two logs in, 18 planks waiting. Are you just not delivering enough wood? Is that what it is? Uh, well, what if I were to... Oh, crikey, I've, 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 for some reason I've opted to, to open everything up there. A tree nursery. I've already had it. Can't do it again. Now, presumably, once I've once I've advanced, maybe I can do it again. But uh, but right now, it's saying, no, you, you've had all the, the advance that we're going to give you for now. 49. There's only 20-some-odd waiting. Because, obviously, if I'm not filling the train up... Uh, then uh, you know everything's going to take a little bit longer to uh, to to do the necessary. We got what have we got waiting? Forty. Although that said, we do have another one, and potentially uh, driving. Uh, here we go. Look, is that 115 people waiting and 200 planks? There's, 100 and, there's 116 people waiting at a station that has no passenger trains. What's the matter with them? Crazy people. Uh, right, okay, well, I possibly ought to uh, break this out and uh, and add it into my, uh, my overall mix, unless there is a tool shop nearby, in which case I could do it there. The other thing I could do... Ha! Huh. Okay, right. All right, here's the scheme there, friends. Right, what we're going to do is we're going to connect up the uh, York Station 5 with York Station 7 and just shuttle people around town like that. I have no idea how it's going to pay off, but they seem to be hungry for it, so we'll give it a go. Meanwhile, we will endeavour to get these planks out of here to uh, the tool works near York uh, because that will make us extra currency. And then, with the extra currency that we're making, we should tip the hundred uh, of your plank currency there, uh, which will allow us to uh, to advance in age. And we're going to do all of that in the next episode, which I do hope you join in for. Uh, I've been Colonel Failure. Um, hurl a like in this direction. I suggest an overarm throw is the most effective. Uh, if you enjoyed this one and uh, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on whatever occurs next which i'm sure will be a delight uh, for both ears and nose at the same time thank you very much for watching i've been colonel failure i'll catch up with you very soon I'm slow back down again cheerio